Hey guys, oh, where am I? At the airport, that's an airplane. I believe in connection of the family. Yeah, I believe in Wi-Fi. No, I'm not talking about internet. I'm talking about a wireless connection between family. I'm talking about trust. I'm talking about working internationally for Israel, Wi-Fi. Yeah, things are heating up. Yeah, Gaza, oof, it's a rocket, four, over 400 rockets firing on civilians in Israel and, and we're having to figure out how to defend ourselves. Uh, our Minister of Defense has resigned, but listen, things are heating up, but in the world it's becoming fashionable to start blaming Israel. Um, which is not cool. Anti-Semitic attitudes are on the rise in the Western world. Blaming Israel and the UN, that's known, but I'm um, just look what's going on in Kansas City, you know, Brussels, Paris, Pittsburgh, right? Even in, in California, there's some algorithm-driven, um, algorithm-driven feeds through social media, which put us in a box and all we're getting is one thing. We need to get out of that. We need to get to broaden our horizons and start connecting with people who we trust, people of truth, real friendships. And, and I believe in that more than ever now. In California, my heart goes out to what's going on there with these fires. But um, there's some other fires, you know, that are that are being driven. And, and in a competitive world filled with, you know, communication challenges, daily digital distractions, the key message isn't heard enough. Um, sometimes we just have to get on a plane and fly there and, t and, and people need to meet and say, hey, we are going to forge a relationship here. We're going to communicate in a real way, heart to heart. We want real friendships. We want to connect and communicate on a deeper level to form crucial relationships that uh, will be all for one and one for all. Uh, the family. So we have to awaken a, a new awareness to foster healthy communication um, and I think that's what part of my role is to do. Uh, that's why I'm flying to over to Minnesota. Yeah, I'm so excited to go and share some of, of what actually the creator of all mankind is up to in and through all of this uh, unrest. And uh, you know, there is good news. Have you heard the saying, when the going gets tough, the tough get going? And I think that's what we're seeing right now. We need to uh, put effort and value on taking time to personally connect. I wanna pray for the peace of Jerusalem, for Israel, the Jewish people around the world, they are, they do have a role in God's plan. These covenants, they're not done with, they're real. Um, our prayers need to go for their protection right now. Um, these descendants of Abraham, we need them to join together. That's right, Ishmael and Isaac, to pray for this true peace. And let's get together and let's see what God has in store for us in this chapter on full world saving the people and land of Israel with unconditional love and an uncompromising faith. Please make your donation today. Your monthly gift is a commitment with us in blessing Israel, blessing God. The Aliyah Return Center, 